Who is he? You should ask him. Me, I'm coming from America. I don't know where, but where is my ass? <laughs> the mother, his mother will tell you because I've not been around. He's probably at the video shoot. Slows and Nzen so so cover Moyero Nemfuko Wared. I think I could go about Wadi and Sabian to spend a couple of years. Wabra Nagina Koranga, Batin, Baby Panda, Bakuba T shirt, Naba from the middle. Neoku Gazako chicken, there's some Yakugama, to one is about the numbers. Zeduan Yawich, Mwagara Kumbora. Mwagala Yes, <laughs> Umusajja asajja kula no gumire bizibu byo no bisolvinga nsamu kama muyambe ne muchalawe abaluna as a mobilizer uh, democratic party my party appointed me as the national mobilizer and then i appointed myself as an international mobilizer i've been in the usa meeting with bp people trying to mobilize more people into the party actually i want dp to be international because dp is Democratic Party, where we have people in DP in the USA, DP people in Japan, and DP everywhere. So what we're trying to do is put our party together and put it in one box and move as one people. I actually want to tell you about this coming weekend, I'm moving to Mutukura, wow. where I have a show combined with my political ambitions. I'm going to sensitization, mobilization. I'm going to meet the traders in Mutukura, because that's a business area. I'm going to meet farmers in Mukoma and Simbi on Saturday. I'm going to meet women associations in Paris. So, so my job as a DP mobilizer is unlimited. Is unlimited. Maybe even if I go to heaven, I'll mobilize more people there. <laughs> yeah. I'm not scared of the regime. I'm not at all scared of the regime. The regime should be actually scared of us. Because I'll give you an example. Is uh, People are saying that musicians have come into politics, but even lawyers went into politics. Even nurses went to politics. Even teachers went to politics. Politics is for everybody, as long as, it is, as long as it's democratic. Politics is for all of us, because it is one people, one nation, one ambition, one direction. There might be threats, of course, that have been starting to rise. Yo, yes, chameleon, this is going to happen, blah, 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 blah. But then, listen to me, if matters could die for religion, <laughs> we are ready for anything. I am not scared about anything. I am not. What about people who take you not serious? <coughs> yeah, those people who take me not serious are actually not serious. <laughs> it is not my problem that you are not serious. It is, how much more do you want me to prove that I am serious? You told me I didn't have a party. I showed you I am a democratic party. You told me I am not... <laughs> I am not revolutionary. But we are still moving. If you think I'm not serious, then you're not serious. It's your problem. But that's one world. You have the right to, to think that I'm not serious, like I have the right to be serious. That's the purpose. Yeah, what people don't differentiate is people power. Even in NRM, there's people power in their own side, in their own power. We are united people power in red and color. We are united people power in red and color. We are the majority. So, if Bobby Wine is telling to you that people are wearing hats and being hyenas in there, then it's too early for him to be scared. We are not at the time of segregation, we are at the time where we should work together as people. The majority, the oppressed and the oppressor. You understand me? So, I don't think it is relevant whether we have a heart or not for now. We should just have the soul for the nation. 
What makes us identical, me and these ladies you see me with, is because we have the same ambitions, same directions. We want the same, we want the same beautiful Uganda after 2021. If people start lamenting about the hearts and who's real and who's not, then we are being selfish upon our leadership. We should be open-minded. <laughs> we are an open country. We are too young or too old to start dealing with such minor problems. We are too young or too old to start dealing with such minor problems. People power. People power. People been promising they don't have solutions that is why we are coming in to try to make it clean we want practical politics we want tangible politics we want practical politics generation we are practical we are millennial generation we are not that generation that generation is gone so that why that is why politics was called a dirty game because the people that went in there became dirty Bagafura Marwa, Batra Kuri Banyua. Bagafura Marwa, Nibanyu Mirwa. That's why many of them are so worried to lose their political positions because that is their job. Police became their job, not a responsibility. And that's what we're coming to do. We're coming to administer and lead the people. I probably want to introduce this award to you people. My fellow Ugandans, my comrades. This is another achievement that I uh, successfully achieved, worked for and earned in Canada as a revolutionary award. Um, when they say it's a revolutionary award, it is not a light word that you can undermine. That means we made music that was revolutionary, music that moved us from one step to the other. So I dedicate this to the people who witnessed my struggle, like the same people who are witnessing the struggle that we are trying to, we are trying to redeem ourselves, ourselves into another form. So, I was very undermined when I, I was very undermined when I started this journey. Actually, my mother thought I was wasting my time. But eventually we became just like we are starting another journey, my political journey, my administrative journey to deliver to the common man the way we deserve. Uh, it is all the way from Canada, handed over by the mayor of the city of Vancouver. That's my award. A lot of youths have been told not to hope in themselves. You've only been shown the one side of the coin, you've not been shown the second side of the coin. They have shown to you that they can provide to you, not showing that you can also provide for yourself. And that is the new monumental journey that we want to start building. We want to start doing things ourselves and deliver ourselves because we've been told we can't, so it is time we show them we can. So I thank you so much for the support, my people. I'm back. Those who thought that I had gone for quite a long time, I hadn't gone for a long time to waste my time. I was doing my music because music was my foundative plan. Now I use my music as an advantage to be able to associate myself, to make new contacts, to look forward to people that are going to help us redeem ourselves to a new nation 2021. So, so my tour was not only musical, it was also political. I was trying to make alliances, looking out for people who are going to help us in redemption. We admire those countries, but when are we going to start the journey to be like them? That is what I'm trying to do. A lot of people have been complaining, saying Camino is not in Uganda and blah, blah, blah. I'm not there wasting my time. I'm not on holiday. I'm there doing research. I'm there making plans. And one of the things that I want to introduce to my people is um, I managed to secure 35,000 digital books. What? I managed to secure 35,000 digital books from, uh, from Netherlands, uh, from a, uh, a company called Light Up Africa. We have 5,000 solar lights for the students. And unfortunately, they want me to have an address where they're going to deliver the lights. So I call upon our leaders who are still in power to help us provide the address so we can deliver that service down to the people because these are free books. And if we want to take this nation forth, we have to have knowledge. 
Where's knowledge? Knowledge is in the books that we read. What? So I kindly request people in authority, whether, whether it's Minister of Education, whether it's Minister of uh, whosoever is concerned, to provide us an address where we're going to deliver, where they're going to deliver the 35,000 digital books that can make a library to help people open their minds, and where we can deliver the uh, 5,000 solar lights that can help the rural people in their areas to be able to read even at night. So that was my tour, and that is still my mission. It is not, I'm not asking for leadership. I am asking for administrative leadership, for practical leadership, where we're going to put things in place. It, I don't, I need an office, yes, I do, to be able to do a lot of things, but I have already started my job to deliver this country from nothing to knowledge and people to delivery. That's what it's about. Njawa Julia, Madam, Kaspati Angela Wanda. Ah, kusaidienu. Ina honorable to be Bukoman Simbi, Mwami Munindwa, Andrew. Boga by DPO. DPO. Hip hop power? Hip power. Ah, kusaidienu, Mama Wafe. Mchala Mayanja, tumongera kodala. Mchala Mayanja Senior. Mama Payas. Mama Payas. Mama Wifi. Mama Wifi. Mama Ah, kumukono gure. Angasina genda wala, wakati mumbani yerodi me yalinzo kula yalinda ofisi. Yesu mumbani. Saidi wali tuina gubaita honorable Angela Chigonya. Yagendo kuwera M. Yagendo kuwera chairmani. Me ya we ruaga. Me ya we ruaga. Dennis, Banka kasa mbuje chini. Amanya gangi. 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 Amanya gangi